Hi, it's Mitch from PickDogs.com here with the free pick in the Mariners versus Mets Major League Baseball matchup on Sunday, August 11th, 2024. If you like all the free picks we do at Pick Dogs, you'll love our premium picks, our best bets. Just go to PickDogs.com, click on the premium picks tab, or I've also got a link in the description. If you make bigger bets, $1,000 or more per game, got a $10,000 or more bankroll, looking for VIP style package, we offer those as well. You just got to text the number that you see on the screen. These are long-term packages, not bailout type bets. And of course, our regular premium picks on the website are our most popular because they reach a larger segment of our audience. You can check those out at the link or at Pick Dogs. Of course, I bet mine every day, even though I am a big better. But let's get to it. Got the Mariners taking on the Mets. Luis Castillo on the bump for the M's. It's Severino on the mound for the Metropolitans. And boy, this is a big game. Even though it's an interleague game, boy, you know, when you look at the standings, the Mariners just really need this one because they are in a dogfight with the Houston Astros in the American League West. Meanwhile, the Mets, while well, sitting now in the wild card, looking out, but that whole thing with the loss column with the Braves, and uh, you know, it's going to be tough for them to catch the D-backs or the Padres, who are starting to put some space in between them and the Chasers, and then you know, the Cardinals and Giants kind of hot on their heels now at this point, just a few games back as well. It is going to come down to the final week of the season, more than likely for that National League wild card. Luis Severino for the Mets, you know, checks in. He's got that 4.06 ERA coming off of a performance against the Rockies where he allowed four runs, six prior to that against the Twins, and two prior to that against the Braves. Not his best stuff here down the stretch, and really over his last 10 games, he hasn't really been at his best. A few really good performances, but really surrounded by getting hit very, very hard. 4.06 ERA, like I said, on the season. 101 strikeouts. 15 home runs allowed over 128 and two-thirds innings of work. Over his last three games, 8.31 ERA. Simply does not get it done. Luis Castillo on the mound for the Mariners. And, you know, Castillo is a guy that we're used to seeing in those low threes, mid two, high two ERA for the season. He's actually not quite there this year. And, you know, I figured maybe down the stretch he would pick it up. But we haven't really seen it, allowing three runs last time out against the Tigers, three runs prior to that against the Red Sox. Against the Angels, we saw the Castillo that, you know, could could toss the shutout. And prior to that, you know, three runs against the Astros in a game that they really needed it, you know. And it's like that could be the one game that's the difference between the Mariners making the playoffs or not making the playoffs because as a wild card, they don't really seem to have much of a shot this year. They are uh, kind of on the outside looking in at that, at everything going on there in the American League with that. We look at how these teams are hitting the baseball coming into this one versus right-handed pitching primarily since we do have two right-handed starters. And neither of them are really hitting righties all that well. 232 for the Mets and 229 for the Mariners. But that Mariners bullpen at 5.40 ERA over the last 10. Well, the Mets are very respectable, 2.45 full run and a half better than their season ERA for their bullpen. When we look at, um, you know, the Mets playing in Seattle, they just have not fared well, you know, playing out there. Three and seven in their last 10 meetings in Seattle. To be honest, you know, I don't like the way either of these teams hit the baseball, but I think that, uh, I think Castillo's chances of coming up big are just a lot better than Severino's to at least put the Mariners in position. I'm going to take the Mariners in this one, and that's going to be my free pick. Of course, while you're doing your picks, putting your bets in, use our free betting tools at sportschatplace.com. They're 100% free, and they'll help put you on the most favorable bets on the board today.